it respawns me automatically. Oh, jeez. Oh, we're gonna... We'll, we'll keep a little graveyard. I think this area down here, we're gonna make our graveyard to count just how many times we die. But until then, ugh, this, this leaves us in a nasty position, because now I have to... Uh, okay, I can right-click and, like, quick-equip them. That's great. Uh, this, we want this. As soon as we can sell this copper short sword, we want to get rid of it. Oh, so that re-rolls our, our item, our, our starting items. Oh, and this is a crap wood bow. No wonder why it, it stinks. Snowball! It, oh, the snowball is ammo? Can I just throw them? Okay, well, the sun's coming up. You hear the change in music. We have to get these zombies out of our graveyard, though. Can we... Okay, we can throw them. Oh, he's gonna run away. Hey. Snowball! Oh, jerk. He wants me to chase him all the way down there. Are you cereal? You cereal and milk as part of this balanced breakfast? I don't trust that. Hopefully I can throw these through. Yeah, I can. Okay, I think we got him. I think we got him. Revenge! Oh. I thought I was going to take falling damage there. Okay, and nothing. Uh, let's get some more platforms. That'll do. And then we can... If we want, we can convert our money, but we don't need to do that. Platform. Boop. Right there. Right here. And then it's a different kind of wood, but it does the job. It's not aesthetically perfect, but... We'll just clear this out. And then we'll go exploring. Ooh, there's some amethyst down here. This purple stuff. Hopefully we can find some more rope. Because what we can do with the amethyst is create a grappling hook. And then once we get the grappling hook, it's really easy for us to move around. But first... Grave marker, boom. Let's edit this. What should it say? Uh, that was... Yeah, this is... That was episode one. First death episode one zombie Eskimo. Oh, you can't you can't scroll by actually there we go. Well, at least we didn't die to a slime. Yet. Okay, there we go. We'll start our sad... Our graves of sadness right there. Hey, it's a penguin! I will let it live for now. And we will need to kill some slimes like this blue slime. To get the gels. Extreme slime killing action! There we go. We'll create little bridges for now so we don't just kill ourselves by falling and then like lose all of our stuff. And then when we get rope, I forget how to. I think maybe you can make it from spider webs or something? Or you can find it in the in the jars. But yeah, one of the advantages of playing expert mode is that there are special expert mode items, which I don't know what they are, but according to the Terraria subreddit, they're pretty good. So let's see what's over this way. 
Oh, we can get some worms if we had a net. I remember that, because fishing's a thing. Yeah, when I played this, I played it on PS3. Oh. Well, it's a giant tree, it is. Uh, yeah, I played it on PS3, like, years ago. Nice. You can get some wood from the giant tree. And let's actually... Before that slime catches up, let's make some more torches. Twelve will have to do. Because <laughs> that's all we can do. Not a whole lot, but it's enough. Here we go. Now we're back in business, but... Yeah, it's like the pets barely worked. And so most of this stuff is new to me. Like, I played around a little bit. As you saw, I had another... I had another character in another world, but there's just so much stuff now that a lot of it, and I've never played expert mode before, so I have no idea what to expect. Hopefully goodies. Oh, more torches. That is convenient. I do know at the, at the bottom of this, there's, there's a chance that there's, like, a room, like, a secret room, and a sword. Oh. Wait, can I not, can I not open that door? Is it because there's a, there's a pot in the way? Can I break that? Oh, it's because of the water. Oh, no. Okay. Maybe it was the pot in the way. Nice. Nice. Actually, I'm curious. Let's see if this is hospitable for housing. Oh. It's missing a light source, but if we... If I give it the old... Boop. Boop. There we go. And now is it... Now is it housingable? Because that'd be pretty funny if we found... We just found a perfect house. Nice. Now we don't have to build one. Ooh. We have a leaf wand. It places leaves. It consumes wood. A living wood lawn. It consumes wood and places living wood. We have 14 lead, which I think is the equivalent of copper. A recall potion. Okay, so those we will put here. Just so it's on our hot bar. Archery potion, not too bad. Torch, we'll torch. And then we will loot the rest. I'm curious to see what this is. Let's go ahead. Oh. Oh, that's neat. And then we can... So it's just a cool way of building wood. We'll take this chest, too. And then, so I, I assume the leaf is similar. It's just like the tree leaves that we saw. It is! Oh, isn't that neato? Of course, you can't harvest those. Maybe you can with something else, but... Wow! That is super cool, fantastical. Those recall potions will help. They'll just teleport us to our base. And then... Oh. Oh, jeez. Okay, we can get up there. I was like, uh-oh. Did we just go underwater and can't get back? Can we place leaves underwater? We can. Nice. But we have to be careful because... We're underground enough that things won't stick to the background right now, so... And then let's see if we can... Drain off... Some of this water... Ugh. Ugh, I need to breathe. Yeah, we don't have any glow sticks, so digging down that far isn't going to be very helpful. There are some webs over there, though. So maybe we cut through this, and getting this wood is, is pretty good. Obviously, need lots of wood. And if we had the grappling hook, we might be able to... Nice. 
scale the tree to see if there's anything on top. But actually, there's some there's some webs down there, so let's get that. Boop. I feel like they're like using a special gaming mouse would be really good here. Because then it just has the num keys built in. I'm sh I'm sure like the big gaming mouses that gaming mice have that. Well, that was neat. A little underground super foresty tree thing. Thanks, world generator. Really appreciate that. You did a stand-up job. And with all these trees, I can't see where the sun is in the sky. We might have to head back to base soon. Ow. 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 Well, I mean, not ow, but could be ow. Who knows? Oh, come on. Ow. Okay, that was ow. But, yeah, I mean, we could co sort of claw our way up the tree, but I don't know if there's anything special on top of there, and we're definitely not suited to take out the flying enemies, especially on expert mode, if we go up too high. Okay, so there's a desert. That's probably pretty bad for us. Oh, no, that's just sand. Oh, wait, no. I bet it transitions to a desert pretty quickly. Yep, that's a desert. This thing is... Oh. Is pretty nasty. Uh, I shall shoot you! Yeah, there we go. Woo! Yeah, so maybe we don't go this way for a bit. Because deserts are super cray. Like, crazy dangerous. And we'll probably get a debuff for being in the desert too long because it's hot. I like how they added the... The... Sort of wavy effect. The heat wave effect or whatever it's called. Oh, we got some gel. Always, always want that gel. It's super good. Ugh. You slimes. You shouldn't take this long to kill. Gotcha. <gasps> Aw, it's another squirrel. We'll let him live. Yay, squirrel. I think if we make a bug net, we can catch him. And Ooh. Is this copper? Oh, so that's copper. All right, well, work on getting some better equipment. Oh, no, Mr. Squirrel. I'm so sorry. You ran into my copper pickaxe. I did not mean to kill you, Mr. Squirrel. Yeah, and definitely off-camera, all set up like chest organization and stuff like that, because that is... Oh, oh no. Oh, geez. Okay. Uh, let's just use a healing potion. There we go. So obviously you can't spam heal potions. There is a cooldown of about a minute, it looks like. Aha! I knew you were going to jump. You predictable slime UI. AI. UI. Why did I say that? I think because I wanted to say you predictable slime you. And I said UI instead. Oh, look at it. It's purple. The purple one is the stronger slime. So. If you're a purple person. You're a stronger, better person because of it. It's just science. Look at him. I'm just going to spam the the button. Furious mouse clicks. There we go. There's some purple gel. I bet it's just going to be normal gel. It is. Oh, there's some underwater here and a jellyfish. Are you jellyfish? Ah. Uh... All right, let's see. Oh, I guess I wouldn't hurt to sort of try to tunnel down there, but. Oh, there's some copper. Look at that. Let's switch back to, oops, hit the wrong key. Totally didn't accidentally open up the start menu. 
Well, that is a lucky find. So much for expert mode. We found a heart thing. A life crystal. It's exactly what it's called. Oops. Oh no. <laughs> I meant to use it, not throw it. Yay! Now we have 120 life instead of 100 life. Which will help us survive. Great, precious, sweet life. And it will slowly work our way over here to see what's up. And then probably, probably go back to our home base. Plop down a furnace with all of our stone. We have 20 gels. But I want to, I want to get to that underground lake because I'm curious. But perhaps now is not the time. It's the nighttime. Oh, we can craft rope just by. We don't need anything special. That's really, that's really useful. Oh, and there we go. But, I'm gonna run away! Oh, I think, I think we can take these clowns. Oh. There is a zombie. It's carrying, like, the zombies carry spears? Is that an expert mode thing? Or did they change that? That, I definitely don't remember that. Oh, man. And they have a ton more HP. Well, he's stuck there. Oh, nope. He can't get out. Forget him. Oh, but this guy, he's gonna do us a bamboozle. Ow! Phew! Close that just in time. Ouch. That, that hurt. So let's go... Ooh, plus three range with our web rope. So that will be good for exploring. We don't need that archery potion on our bar. Let's see. What? What? Yay! We did a thing. We can build chests. Is this a... Oh, we can build a wooden fishing pole. Requires bait, which we don't have. Perhaps we should have saved some of our web, just in case we needed that for something else. Armor statue, lead anvil. Oh, a furnace. And an anvil. Our bow... Wait, what? Oh. Because I moved away. It's like, both of these things are very important. And now if I stay in the middle here, we should have all sorts of things we can craft. We could craft a reinforced fishing. I did not mean to craft that. I just wanted to click on it. Oh, geez. Uh-oh. Well, now we have a fishing pole. We probably need... Ooh, chains can be climbed on. That's neat. What do those require? Any iron bars. So probably like the lead. Copper bars. How much copper do we have? Not too much. We have two copper bars. Yay. I don't think that armor statue will help. Or does it give a buff? I don't know. Let's just place that through the roof there. Let's see, we can have minecart tracks, lead fence... Okay. No weapons or armor, though. We could stock up on arrows, which I think will do that. 425. I think that should be enough. And then we are out of wood, it looks like. Oh, and that zombie's defiling our graves. No. Oh. Y'all need to quit jumping around. It's rude. Also, I'm scared of you. Because you'll kill me, like, instantly. Okay. They... Died. Good thing there's no floaty eyeballs. It's just zombies. The floaty eyes are... are wicked tough. Alright. 
I need you to shoot this. Brian? Brian. Brian. Listen to me. I need you to shoot that guy. I need you to. I need you to shoot that guy when I open the door. Okay, Brian? Can you do that? Don't push me, don't push me down here! Oh! Oh! Oh, that was an awful idea! Brian, you are the worst! Why did you not shoot him? Oh! Well, our grave marker's down there. Oh! Oh, now you shoot them. Well, at least we're conveniently next to the one. Oh, oh jeez, oh jeez, no, 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 oh, oh no, oh no, please no. You stay, you stay there. I need to equip my stuff. Oh, is it almost day? Are you running away? See, now he does his job after I get killed. What a jerk. I'm gonna so enjoy throwing you in lava. Oh, oh no, there's a floating eye thing. Oh jeez, oh jeez, save me guide, save me! Oh! Okay. This might be a little tougher than we thought. Oh, and the guide died too. Oh jeez, 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 jeez. Okay, get out of here. Go away, zombies. No one likes you. Is this still nighttime? Oh, That is not good. I need my stuff. Oh, that star that I was holding on is going to disappear if it turns into day. That's not cool. I need those for magic. But I can't get them because... I have no armor, just this fantastic trench coat and a ridiculous mohawk. Yeah, I don't even have my snowballs to throw at them. I am completely defenseless and I can't do anything because this demon eye here with 130 HP. Oh, expert mode's right. It's like I can't grab my stuff quick enough to then fight them off. So, I'll just cut to daytime. Minions! Thank you so much for watching this episode of Conquest Terraria Expert Mode. Things are only going to get more intense, so be sure to subscribe to the channel so you're always up to date. Like the video too, because it makes me feel good. And share this with your friends and family to get the word out about the growing Overlord Empire for the glory of demankind.